My name is Colonel Mark Anarumo. I'm the permanent professor and department head for character and leadership development at the Air Force Academy, and this is my warrior story. So my story is a little unique. I did not take the traditional path to get where I am today. I actually left high school when I was 16 and joined the Army, which at the time was a uh, tremendous leap of faith, but it really wound up saving my life and getting on a path that I found to be the most rewarding life I could have possibly lived. Um, you know, the Army set me up for success. It gave me a remarkable foundation and really inculcated me with this worry ethos from the time I was a 16 and a half year old troubled young man from New Jersey. And through my life, I've been able to apply the same lessons I learned early. After being an armored crewman on M1 tanks for a while in the Army, I got to attend college and the Air Force has paid for my bachelor's, master's, and PhD. It's been a truly blessed life, but really most of my career has been spent in the field. Um, and doing warrior things. You know, for example, there were times in Iraq and Afghanistan, especially during the, uh, the height of combat operations where we'd be you know, ground battlefield airmen out there uh, with the Army, with the Marines, really showing how great the Air Force is and they, they wound up really respecting us as an institution due to our experiences with them in the field. In times you'd be on a three-day patrol and you'd lose somebody. You'd lose an airman to combat action, which is rare, and we'd have you know, guys that were up for three days, they were, uh, hadn't eaten, hadn't bathed, and all of a sudden they're back and uh, it's time for the funeral. They fall in the airman uh, ceremony. We bring them to the aircraft to evacuate the, uh, the remains. And they'd stay up because it was important them to be part of the uh, ceremony and line the streets and bring them all the way to the uh, aircraft. This is an institutional effort. CCLD is leading the effort. Um, I'm just very proud to be part of it. And it's going to really be important in the institution, both the permanent party and our cadets and our guests. You know, the speaker lineup, et cetera, it's going to be uh, things that really make us consider what warrior ethos is, what the profession of arms is. It's going to be introspective. It's going to be very emotional. We want to, we want to kind of generate some intellectual and academic curiosity. We're hoping this is going to lead to creating better warriors, you know, understanding the ethos much better, generating more scholarship, and many other very, very positive effects. And we're expecting this to be a world-class event. And I really just want to welcome everybody to, uh, and get them excited about NCLS. I am Colonel Mark Anarumo, and I am a warrior.